Let's talk about exposure. Exposure is a somewhat broad topic. A lot of things relate to it, but let's see if I can boil it down for you. Exposure is the amount of light being allowed to fall on the image sensor of your DSLR. But there's no exposure button on your camera. There's no one number that you can set for it. It, meaning the amount of light being let into the camera, is determined by a few things. Now, don't get exposure confused with ISO sensitivity. ISO is one thing that affects exposure, but ISO sensitivity refers to how sensitive the sensor is to the light that comes in. Exposure simply refers to the light. When someone says getting the right exposure, they mean getting the right amount of light into the camera. And really, you know, right for you might be different than right for me, depending on how I want the photograph to look. There are three things that affect exposure. Aperture, shutter speed, and ISO sensitivity. Each of these items affects how much light makes it onto your photograph. Let's talk about a situation. These are the camera settings. Aperture of f4, shutter speed of 1 100th, and ISO sensitivity of 400. Now let me show you how changing each of those items would affect exposure, which, remember, is simply the amount of light being let into the camera. So here's our scenario. Aperture of f4, shutter speed of 1 100th, and ISO sensitivity of 400. Let's change aperture first. If we widen our aperture to f2.8, we're letting more light into the camera, so our exposure is going to go up. But if we narrow our aperture to f11, not as much light can get in, so our exposure is going to go down. Next, let's talk about shutter speed. Keeping our aperture at f4 and our ISO at 400, let's change this, this shutter speed. If we speed up the shutter speed to 1 500th, not as much light can get in, so our exposure is going to go down. But if we slow our shutter speed more light, there's going to be more time for the light to get in, so our exposure is going to go up. And last, if we leave aperture at f4 and shutter speed at 1 100th, if we change our ISO from 400 to 1600, we are increasing our image sensor sensitivity, so our exposure is going to go up. But if we decrease the sensitivity to light to, say, 100, our exposure is going to go down. So, if you want a brighter exposure or more light in your photo, you have some options. You can set a slower shutter speed, which lets more light in and gives you a brighter exposure, or a wider aperture, which lets more light in and gives you a brighter exposure, or a higher ISO number, which makes the sensor more sensitive to light, which gives you a brighter exposure. It's actually that easy. If you're just learning, don't get confused with all the other things like exposure compensation and metering. Start out by experimenting with aperture, shutter speed, and ISO sensitivity. Leave two of those items the same and adjust the third to see what happens. Let me know if you have any questions.